kuchukuliwa na hii serikali ya kunyakua hauwezi nyakua kila pesa ya mtu umwache bila chakula ukisema ni kodi unatafuta hauwezi ondoa pesa ya shule tulijua free primary na free secondary sasa tunasikia watoto wakiitishwa pesa kila mahali huwezi anza upanguzi kwa watoto wa university uwe na method ya kujua ni mtoto gani utapatia pesa ni gani utagandamiza hiyo ni kuharibu elimu gharama ya maisha haiwezi panda mpaka kila mtu anatetemeka kwake nyumbani mimi nasema kwa vile masungumzo haikuleta mambo ya gharama ya maisha wa Kenya mkumbuke katiba imekupatia nguvu kila mtu aende kwake nyumbani tujiulize ni lini tutasema enough is enough punda imeanguka punda ilikuwa imechoka sasa imefanya nini imeanguka hii ni wakati mbaya tunahitaji watu wa ukweli tunahitaji watu kama mzee Kigoro watu watasimama na wakenya kwa jia ya ukweli umoja wa Afrika Afrika Union ni umoja wa viongozi sio umoja wa watu wa Afrika na viongozi wa Afrika wakati mwingi wanakuwa viongozi wa kutukandamiza sio viongozi wa wa kuinua watu wa kawaida hivyo basi watu wa kawaida tuungane sisi pamoja tujenge umoja wetu sio umoja wa viongozi tena tumesikia katika university hizi maneno ya school fees hizi bursary ambazo zimetolewa na serikali kuu tunasikia majina imeenda na watoto wetu wale wako university wanafanyiwa ukora namna hii mada karua nikikuja wewe ni kuambia watu wetu wa kisi wana, wanajaribu kunyanyaswa eti tusiende tukapate elimu kuu katika university kule juu ungana na sisi tunataka kama bursary inapeana kwa wanafunzi wa university hata sisi wa kisi tunatoa kodi si tunatoa kodi hatutakubali vile baba ameongea na wengine vile wameongea ukweli ni ya kwamba kuna shida ya mambo ya economy na wa country kwa hivyo tunatafuta mbinu ili tuhakikishe ya kwamba watu wetu wanapata afueni the people are suffering today the cost of living is very high gharama ya maisha imepanda bei ya unga imepanda bei ya mafuta imepanda bei ya sukari imepanda gorogoro imepanda wale sema ati hapa kisi gorogoro sasa ni shilingi 1500 ni kweli ni 50 kweli eh sasa wame sema mambo mengi sana ile lugha ambayo ilikuwa na wanaongea ya toka chini kwenda juu mama mama mboga jua kali boda boda hiyo lugha sasa imesaulika sasa wazao mambo boda boda na mama mboga sio kila kitu ushuru ushuru nasema punda imechoka kisa sasa nasema punda imeanguka ni punda imeanguka sasa Hawezi kubeba mzigo tena. Hakuna chochote mba yiku hapu. Na kila siku ni ahadi. Ahadi. Barabara hii tutajenga. Shule hii tutajenga. Sibitali hii tatunainua level 6. Hiyo yote ni takataka. Devolution is right now on trial. Because you see attempts to revive other structures which are gone with the old constitution. We see attempt to revive a provincial administration which had gone with the old constitution. You know how st uh, structures like regional commissioner, county commissioner going down here is basically an attempt to try to undermine the authority 
of elected leadership in the counties. And this must be resisted. The current constitution does not have provision for provincial administration. In the county, the governor is the chief executive. And the governor needs to be given powers and respect that he deserves. But when you have a situation where a non-elected person appointed in the name of county commissioner, regional commissioner, giving orders for property of people to be destroyed, we said, Shaitani 